I've got some FabFitFun mystery bundles and extras. So if you want to see what's in these mystery bundles, stay tuned. Hi and welcome to our channel. My name is Tracy. Chloe and Bandit aren't with me this evening, but if you're new, thanks so much for stopping by. And if you're returning, thank you so much for being a part of our YouTube family. So I have some FabFitFun mystery bundles slash extras. And um, I am without eye makeup today because I do have to film my Sassy Divas collab later on. And that's going to be a little bit of a wild look. So hopefully you caught that. And if not, it's in with my video. So check that out. But I didn't want to do all my videos looking that extreme. Oh, my lips are looking a little extreme because I just put on the lip injection from Too Faced and wow that is looking huge if you do not like lip plumpers you will not like theirs it it almost makes your tongue go tongue go numb for a few moments after you use it but I'm an older gal and I need that smoothness in my lips so I need the Plumpers. All right, I have a handful of items that I ordered and then two mystery bundles in here. So the first thing is the Lemmy Focus Concentration Gummies. We did get these, not this particular one, but this brand was a choice in the winter box. And I actually really enjoy what I'm, what I'm using right now. So I thought, well, let me try these. Um, I mean, Actually, it's more for Chloe because she needs some help focusing in my husband. They're both all over the place. Next by Fenty Beauty. This is a semi-matte lipstick. So this is a refill. I don't have their actual, like they have a thing that they sell. But if I leave this on my makeup stand it should be fine so there we go this is in the shade pose queen and it's just a neutral but I thought that would look I thought that would look nice kind of mixed in with maybe something else by hourglass I believe this came as two for a really good price now these are again the refills I don't have their stick that comes in This shade is called When I Was. And that's that pretty pink color underneath. And there are two of the refills. And it has that nice little case so that you could even travel with that. And you really don't need the fancy um, holder for it. By Ellis Brooklyn, I have their Fawn scent. They just had two more in their most recent sale. And I had them in my cart, but I was like, you know what? I'm good. I do like the scents I've tried so far. This is a cruelty free brand. And there's how it looks. Oh, that smells nice. It's got like a musk undertone, but there's this lightness about it on the top. So I do like that. And then the last thing that I chose was by Skylar. Skylar, this is the Cocoa Cabin. It has scents of cocoa. Almond Blossom and Chestnut. This is also a cruelty free brand. It's sometimes hard to find cruelty brands in fragrances, but they are uh, more and more, I think you're finding. Oh, that's a nice warm scent. All right, I have two mystery bundles. Let's see what we've got and what's gonna go in a gift and a giveaway pile. And that is one of the things that I do like about these. Now these were, $29 bundles. They have since gone back up to $39. So I did not get any of this, this go around. So these are from a previous, like a, I don't know, right around Christmas time sale. This is 2301 MYS020. We do have, looks like three items. By Jamelli, we have these hair ties, 
And they're nice little cloth ones, but they are a little bit fancier than um, I or my daughter might wear. So I'll see if my mom wants them. If not, they're probably going to go into a giveaway box. There's nothing wrong with them. They're just, I don't have a lot of hair. So something like this calls attention to all that. I don't really wear my hair up too often because of that. And if I do, it's usually just in a clip. I just, you put it up and it looks like toddler hair. Next by Fig One is a micellar oil cleanser. This has grapeseed oil and squalane. Here's how this looks. And this bottom part is refillable. So you just save this part and you recycle this part, I guess is what they say. And you can just buy the refills, put the pump back in. So micellar water is something that we only have a little bit of at my house. It's not something I see frequently, so I will probably keep this because I think it's something we could actually use. All right, the next thing is a two set. So even though there's only three things in here, I guess because this is a set of two, I'm pretty excited about it. This is by Fenty. This is their Gloss Balm Cream Duo. And the bright pink is called bubble binge and then this more creamy one is called cupcake -ing. all right there we go these i definitely would have purchased so i'm pretty excited so that's even more pinky than i thought it would be i thought it would be more of like a nude pink but definitely like that color there we go. It's definitely like that Barbie pink color of last year. That's the first bundle. The second bundle does have four items and it is 2304 MYS053. All right, so the first thing is by Zoe Isla and it's a quartz facial roller. And I mean, I have so many of these types of things that this is definitely going to go in a giveaway. I have an Enriching Bright Eye Cream by No, and I'm pretty sure I actually purchased this Wicked Cheap from the last sale. All right, there is how that looks. By Ole Hendrickson is a Barrier Booster Orange Ferment Essence. So an essence is similar to a toner. And Ole Hendrickson's a really good brand, so I'm super excited about this. It's probably got a seal in there, and I'm not ready to open a new one. Nope. Oh, it smells very orangey. I like that. And the last product in here is by MKS, and it is the Whip Skin Butter in Original Scent. So I thought this was going to be a hair product because I've only gotten hair products by this brand. Mm, that's quite lovely. Okay. All right, these two things I'm not sure what I'm going to do with, if I'm going to give them away or gift them, but um, I don't think I need any more body butters. I'll have to look at my stash. I think I have quite a few, but this smells very lovely. And this is a cruelty-free brand. So that information you will have seen as I showed you the products. I do look that up for you guys to let you know. All right. So that is my little FabFitFun bundle. Which one was it better? Do you think one or two? I think they both had some real high points. Like I'm really excited about these Fenty lippies. Like those are, and this is a bright color, but I think if you mix them up a little bit, you're gonna get a lovely color. So there they are mixed up and that's a real pretty color. So you can even mix them with, with those as well. Like that pink with that nude would probably be really, really pretty together. Um, in, this, in the second bundle, the Essence. I mean, this I actually believe I purchased, so I don't need a second one. I probably didn't need the first one, but I think it was like, 
$3 or $5. And I've always got friends at work who are looking for eye creams and such. And this is for brightening. And I know a couple of my friends feel like they have some darkness under their eyes. So they're looking for things. So I was like, you know what, for three or five bucks, I'll just pick that up, give it to a friend. And then this smells lovely. And I do love a good body butter. All right. So which one was better? Let me know. Um, all right. Thank you so much for spending a little time with me. Please consider hitting that like, subscribe, and notification bell, and hopefully I'll see you soon.